We begin with breaking news in southwest Houston. A teenager in a car shot and wounded this morning. Houston police are investigating the scene on South Gessner at West Belfort. This is across the street from HISD's Louis Welter Middle School, which then went into lockdown. Good afternoon. I'm Sharon Min Chow. Jason Miles joins us now live from the scene. Jason. That teenager you mentioned that was shot while riding inside a car just happened to be coming through here at the time should be OK. More on that in a second. But let's first start with some video uh, from the scene. All of this starting just before eight o'clock today, as you mentioned, near Welch Middle School. Now, according to HPD, who is also working with HISD police, they say uh, a disturbance, a disagreement between two juveniles yesterday kind of spilled into this morning. One juvenile shot multiple times at the other juvenile, both teenagers, as that uh, person who was being shot at ran across uh, Gessner toward the school. In the meantime, some stray bullets hit not only a teenager riding inside a car, a 14 year old who just happened to be passing by. It also struck a pickup truck. You may have seen behind me. Those, those people are now fixing their tire that was struck by a bullet. Now, according to HPD, uh, they are still trying to identify the suspect only described as a Hispanic male between 14 and 16. Meantime, the young man who was being shot at ran into Welch Middle School that was in secure mode for a very brief period of time. Uh, as for that 14 year old who was struck, here's a little bit more on what police told us about him. The passenger, who was a 14 year old juvenile, got struck on the right side of his body. Since then, he has been transported to Texas Medical Hospital, where he's expected to, uh, to survive. And again, all of this remains under investigation. Police reiterated that none of this happened on the Welch Middle School campus, but it obviously involves at least one Welch Middle School student. Um, we are still on the scene trying to uh, process uh, all of the information that came out. And as I mentioned, that pickup truck behind me, the mother very grateful, a child who was riding in that truck with her was not struck, although her tire was struck. I'll have much more on this coming up later on KHOU. Shernman. Wow, scary for so many reasons. Jason Miles, thank you, sir. We will continue to follow the story online.